Hi guys, RT here. So this is an AFK Journey video. So this video is mainly talking about uh, I've been playing AFK Journey uh, for 21 days and I am not a free to play, okay? I am a dolphin spender. I spend like most of the val the packs that are very value. And you can see I have a Vala skin. That that so you can kinda estimate how much I spend on the game. So uh, let me briefly go through um, what I have or what is the progress in my current account. So I have the Wolf Slayer account, um, title here, which is the top 20 um, Wolf Killer of the Lone Gaze. So I have the title here, this title is permanent, and then I have the frame as well, you can see top right here, and this is my total power for now. 8000k 8, is my total power. And then let me show you my um, character that I have. So currently I my resonance level is 180, and then I have three character 190. Now I'm going to have another 190 today, um, as long as I AFK long enough and then these are my character focus so you can see mainly all of them are more focused towards PvE and there's some character that I get is uh, investing for future PvP because if you are a dislike viewer that, that you, you notice my channel because of dislike then you'll know that I mostly focus on PvE content first then when I have enough resources to actually compete in PvP then I will only um, look forward into pvp right but afk journey is more about um like collecting characters um upgrading the resonance as um, what's that called ascension or resonance and then you go fight the bosses right that, then they're mostly pve content so i'm mostly invested in pve like, like audi you can see my audi here is supreme plus i just managed to get him to supreme plus today by using the dream realm token and then i invested his um, weapon until level 13 Right, I have not enough, not enough um, resources to upgrade to 15 but Audi carries me in all PvE and PvP content as well because um, his end game is very good he can instantly kill someone when you reach a certain threshold limit and um, the other characters, so this one is the, I like the best tank the best healer, the best um, assassin in the game to actually fight in PvP and PvE I'm also using her a lot especially in Lone Gaze as well so I, I do see her potential in PvE so I try to get as many copy uh, as possible for her okay then um, Shaki is not bad in PvP and then I have him to Supreme Plus because in PvE he is also a very good character then the other character here are mostly invested for future PvP like uh, Iron here um, Carolina here is invested for future PvP. I don't really use them a lot in my current progress, but they are more um, investment for the future. Then Riley here, I also invested a lot on her because of the, uh, went to Supreme, and then I'm going to make her plus ten for her weapon to increase more attack bonus from the passive EX here. Right, I just need four more of the yellow thing. Okay, so this is my. Um, current character and my I have I'm pretty lucky with my Rainier here as uh, I got two time back to back so it's pretty lucky I did I did pop, I did bought, purchase the packs okay I did purchase um, the pop-up packs about uh, Rainier so I did I just need one more copy away then I mythical plus right so usually I yes I'm a dolphin player yes I pay to win but um, I'm more focused on targeting what is the value pack or what is the pack that is um, more needed instead of just wheeling every single pack it pops up right so yeah so this is my resonance hall and then let's take a look at my current inventory so this is the resources I have left I'm saving for the next one so um, this one is the universal Omnicron I have like 548 and then the blue one I always buy them because when you when you have a new character you want to level up them you're gonna need the blue one right and these are the other resources i have and then for the imperium here i always buy out everything here unless unless you are lack of gem then a diamond then you don't buy this right then for my recruitment store arena dream store you can see i purchased a lot of audi it only left four copy for me Okay, then for my progress level of AFK progress is now 1002. It's almost um, finishing because if not mistaken, the end part here is like 1250, is it? Then there's no more AFK progress for to push. But so now currently 21 day is uh, 1002 progress. Then for the battle modes here, all of my dream bosses now is already at endless mode. 
and I can hit into top 20 easily with my current setup because I'm more focused on PvE so all my characters here are more towards PvE based you can see that the one that I'm using usually is the PvE use one so all bosses I can go into top 20 um, comfortably so I can get either this tier of reward or this tier of reward so I have these resources to um, invest into um, the future because um, in the early to mid game you're gonna need a lot of the blue and yellow especially the yellow one to upgrade the exclusive weapon then you can only start using the red one and the the part that you can, you can get the red one is from arena the arena um, ranking rewards right where is it yeah this one you can get this weekly but this one you can only use it after 16 to 25 so um, it's more important to get the yellow one first instead of the red one so investing in pve is more important for me that's why i invested more so and my progress for the dream realm everything is um top 20 everything is top 20 and then I think the rest okay so for my arena progress uh, i'm usually around top 20 to top sorry top 21 to top 100 between here so i can get a daily rewards of a uh, 630 with some extra bonus then it's around 788 okay i can't i can't hit here but maybe in the future when i focus into pvp character more then for my legend of trial this is all my progress now i haven't pushed um today's one but you can see my beast one is more higher is 71 but after you push until 90 there's, then there's nothing else for you to push anymore this is my legend trial um, progress and then for my arcane, arcane laboratory is difficulty 13 you can't really push higher because i i'm kept by the resonance then i think that's all which this is what i can show right this oh maybe i can show this one as well so my mythical collection so my mythical collection this is all my mythical collection progress the dream uh, the dream one is max the summon one is max the pvp one is max the king glory which is the pay to win one um, the first phase is max and then this one is the another version like after king glory then you're gonna unlock this true emblem then this one is the resonance level one it's going to uh, unlock this one when it's 200 then this is the bonus um overall that i have you can consider this as a pv um vip system right right so i think that's all for the video today so it's, just, it's just mostly like showing what i have as a dolphin player and playing for 21 day so you can like kind of compare with yourself is it really worth to pay to win in an idol game and yeah so it really depends on you because i pay to win the idol game since i'm since i'm making content for it so it's fine right and i enjoy the game but yeah it really depends on you all right so hope you guys enjoyed the video and see you guys in the next video bye bye special thanks for the direct support on the youtube membership so for the benefactor of our tier which is gen mp rosas 15 mokul rajali thank you so much for the support and special thanks to merlin williams for the highest tips giver in my live stream support and for the supporter and patron of our tier which is louis shenader acne jam mai code wilderness wang tamer rimu chani ziggy kamaruki sunwaltz racketus cult worshipper von hexa and looks lee thank you so much for the support and special thanks to Jen MP, Mortal Rajili, Jen Mai, Code Wilderness, Wang Tamer for the one month streak of support, and Louis Shenader and Acne for the three month streak of support. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video and see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.